Hello guys, welcome to yet another video of SpaceX updates. The year 2022 is about to end, but not just yet for SpaceX. For the 60th time in 2022, today, SpaceX launched a Falcon 9 rocket from SLC-40 from Cape Canaveral Space Force Station in Florida. Two, one, engine full power, and lift off of Carbon 5.1. Another batch of the newest and upgraded 54 Starlink satellites took a ride to space on a booster which was on its 11th flight. This particular booster was the most flown booster this year for a record eighth time in a single calendar year. SpaceX may not just be over yet with launching rockets, one more mission is on the list to end the year with, the Eero C-3 mission from Vandenberg Space Force Base in California. SpaceX chief Elon Musk congratulated the Falcon 9 team for completing a record 60 launches in 2022, the most by any company or agency this year. Going across Texas, with the temperature rising up slowly after a brutal winter storm across the whole country, crews are returning to work. You may think it's the time of the year when people should relax and enjoy the holiday season, but the work culture is different at SpaceX, that's why they are the best in the world. Inside the Mega Bay at the production site, assembly of Booster 10 has already started. Booster 10's downcomer tube was installed yesterday. From this point, SpaceX will only ramp up the production of Starship and boosters. It will be an utter shame if SpaceX cannot launch the first Starship flight next year. From launching its own upgraded larger Starlink satellites to demonstrating various capabilities of the rocket to its major customer NASA for the Artemis program, we are expecting to see at least a few flights of Starship next year. Last week, NASA announced that SpaceX was awarded a $97 million contract to launch the joint U.S.-European Sentinel-6B radar satellite as early as November 2025. Unconfirmed reports are suggesting that SpaceX has been contacted by NASA over a talk to bring home the crew members of the Soyuz MS-22 mission. Last week, we saw a scary leak on the spacecraft which is still attached to the ISS. For now, there is no guarantee that the spacecraft is safe enough to travel back to Earth with crews inside it. It will be interesting to see if SpaceX will be able to step up to such an unplanned mission in case of an emergency situation, and I think they totally can do it if needed. That is it for this video guys, I hope to see you again in the next video with more updates.